The U.S. Postal Service really, really, really needs help. Staffing shortages have plagued the agency, causing so many issues in the high country this winter. State and federal leaders started getting involved. Tomorrow, USPS is hosting a day of hiring fairs at eight spots across Colorado. Nine News reporter Jennifer Meckles has an update on the situation. It was a rough winter in the high country. Right now, we're, we're sort of at a point in time to where we don't know what to do. No, not the snow part, the bring your own chair to the post office part. We're all literally starving to try and find a message that's clear, responsive, and, and most importantly, effective. And we're just lacking that from the United States Postal Service. Two and a half months later, after letters from congressmen, meetings with senators, and USPS moving around resources, some high country leadership says they finally see some progress. Mainly what we what we really tried to do was was assist them by providing affordable housing and or temporary housing, which um, surprisingly and, and, and for our benefit, they took us up on a couple offers. So now we have two uh, as of today, United States Postal Service employees taking us up on affordable housing. We still don't have any real communication from the Postal Service, which is frustrating. But anecdotally, I can say that the phone calls and the emails to town hall have been greatly reduced. USPS says they have now replaced highway contractors they lost this winter. They've deployed staff from surrounding communities and hired some new staff in mountain towns. While USPS says service has stabilized and there are no current backlogs, they still aren't fully staffed and still looking to hire. And there are just some big structural issues that need to be addressed if we're going to see um, you know, the, set, the level of service that uh, mountain communities deserve that's on par with the rest of the country. The United States Postal Service is, is obviously a, a great entity to work for, uh, wonderful benefits. So we're excited, hopefully, that they bring in some more employees and can help us and better provide service to our residents here in Summit County. There are eight USPS offices part of tomorrow's hiring fair. Buena Vista, Crested Butte, Dillon, Durango, Edwards, Golden, Steamboat Springs, and Vail. Yes, I know that's a lot, but you can find this list and some information on our website, 9news.com. Yeah, eight locations. Hopefully this revs up hiring because as we, you know, discussed in the last few years, it's like everybody wants to say snail mail is antiquated until you need a prescription, you're getting a check, and then you need your mail. Mm -hmm. A jury summons comes for you. Yes, yes. There's there plenty of go. things that people still need and time, time is important here. So, all right, those details on our website. Jenny, thanks.